so we're here on the job site. We made it. We have our material right here that we got picked up at McCoy's. This is the first round of material. We got some of the cedar. A lot of the cedar's on order. It's because it's special length, special cuts. It's gonna take a couple weeks to get here. And get the trailer unstrapped, unloaded, get my tools out of the truck, get that loaded, un unloaded back to the backyard and start doing the layout. unloaded lumber's all unloaded let me show you a quick real quick whole back Lake. part right here it's gonna be framed up with dimensional lumber that back part over there where you see the water line spigot stub out <clears throat> the gas line stub out and the electric stub out for the sub panel and behind me what you'll be essentially looking at is a raised cedar truss gable roof all right so my goal today work on this back section we need to get that built first and get the columns set. That way when the beams come in, we can start stretching these beams across. Quick update. Got this first wall pretty much laid out. This is where the door opening is gonna be. Next is just go ahead and nail all the studs on the bottom plate first. Then run this top plate header here for the door. And gonna go lift it up, brace it. of it anyway all the studs everything's nailed in uh, improvising on the top plate there I don't like doing that when I know I can make a complete run with a longer board had a 16 foot treated 2x6 I just didn't want to use that because I still have some more walls to frame out with the 2x6 but we made it work got the door header in cripples jack studs king studs all that's done everything's nailed screwed together so now's the fun part lift it in place usually this is a job for two people Got a brace over there ready to go so when the wall stands up, I can use my way over there, screw it in, got to anchor it into the ground over there. It's a two by six wall, so it's usually pretty stable once it gets up. up for the day two by six wall done I got these two inside walls for the uh, storage room all framed up everything's attached I haven't anchored anything down yet we're still braced up it'll be good for I'm gonna put one anchor in it just to keep it down for the evening but you can see kind of up there why I left that down it's for my two by ten beam that's gonna run across there to that column over there the same thing, I left the bottom plate open. Gonna be two studs down there too to catch that beam going across. So again, this is gonna be all open under here. Good progress for the day, I'm happy. Get back at it tomorrow, get the rest of the walls framed up.